I'm working on my business plan right now. Okay. So I can get things rolling. I definitely, I'm only 50% through all your videos on the YouTube page. So the supplier credit, I have to get to that. Get to that. Yeah, take a look at the supplier credit. And in fact, I'm going to make like maybe a three or four part series on supplier credit. I have a lot of things in queue. So I'm, yeah, I'm working on it, buddy. But, you know, I like to remind people, I'm out here doing the same thing that you're doing, bidding contracts, you know, doing business development, networking, going to conferences, attending events, um, shaking hands. So I'm, you know, I'm out here doing the same thing. I'm, I'm trying to, uh, you know, help people as much as possible in the time that I have available. And I really appreciate it. You've been an eye-opener for me. No, I, listen, I'm telling you, man, I, I promise you, it's people like you that uh, kept me going, um, you know, and, and, and got, encouraged me to take a lot more of my spare time and do this rather than, you know, watching Netflix or going to the movies and stuff like that. So this has become a, a hobby for me. And I, and I really enjoy I enjoy talking to you. I enjoy talking to people and hearing their stories. Uh, it's a lot of fun. You know, I mean, I look forward to this. I'm, I'm, as, I'm just as excited as you are, believe it or not. I really, and it, people close to me know that I, I have, I receive as great, if not more joy by your success stories than I do for my own success. Uh, because, I can you know, imagine. You, understand, you can understand that if you can understand, if that makes sense to you. Um, you know, really, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's easy for me to go out and do steps that I tell myself, right? So if you were to say, like, if you make a decision to go and walk a mile today, that's easy for you. But for you to convince someone else to walk a mile, it takes a whole nother skill set. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And, and so that's kind of where I'm at. It's like, you know, I can, yeah, I can go out and do all this stuff myself. But to, to be able to have people go out and do the activities and get favorable responses and, and you know and surprise you know a lot of times they even surprise themselves how quickly these things work and how easy they work um you know once you once people break through that fear um mm -hmm. you know and, you know there's a certain level right once you break through that 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 initial fear then you'll be surprised how quickly these things start coming together for you you'll be i mean i'm yeah. telling you i have people in the group that they 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 i mean like you said they were astonished that you know, they just they they, had, they 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 operated on blind faith, and they said, you know what, Eric, I'm going to trust what you said. I'm going to go ahead and, and call this person, and, and I'm going to try these things and see if it works, and it worked out for them. But uh, you know, if again, if you don't do the steps, you don't do the activities, then you know it won't work. Right. So, right. Definitely. You know, it seems like, um, and then I, you know, I'm going to say this before I let you go. I wouldn't spend so much time, you know, on a business plan. There's nothing wrong with it because it allows you to start thinking about the things that are coming up. But I'm more from the school of, you know, ready, fire, aim. So, yeah. you know, I mean, you, you've got to get your feet wet. You've got to get dirty. You've got to get in the game. Um, you have to call some people. You've got to go out and talk to some folks. Um, you know, uh, I'll give you an example story. My brother, you know, he's a, he's a veteran as well. And uh, he was applying for a service stable status. And I told him, I said, listen, why don't you um, go down, since you're working at the VA hospital, go down to the VA hospital, go to the contracting office, and just start talking to them about some of the opportunities that they have available. And much like yourself, you know, he went down there, he just started talking to the people, because he, I mean, he's there anyways, right? He's at the hospital, he's an employee, he doesn't have to get special access, he's already there. You know, he just went in there and started talking to the people, and, you know, they start opening up to him about opportunities that exist. So again, you know, a lot of times we don't think about the access that we already have. Certain people that I right. talk to, they're already working on military bases. They're already working for prime contractors. They forget that you already have access that some of us, you know, like, you know, we, we look at it like, oh, well, Eric is not, you know, he doesn't have a, a nine to five job, so he has a, a greater advantage. But, you know, I've talked to people who work for companies that are outgrowing their, their size and they can no longer get small contracts and they didn't even think. To, to bother asking, you know, the company that they already work for about maybe open up a business and then allowing them to help uh, work, to, you know, partner together on some of these opportunities. You know, it kind of goes over your head a lot of times. You don't see the obvious. Um, right. So, uh, you know, when you, I mean, you're, you're at a company working a nine to five, that company may have opportunities available um, for you or for someone who wants to go out and create an entity and start working together with them. 
So I've already been in talks with uh, some of the people, and plus, they want me off the books anyway. They want to make me a 1099 see? contractor anyway. So, so that, so again, so you see how that, how easily, you know, that can flow right into you getting your own contracts, because because right. if they do that, you can start putting this into your company name and start building history, because now you're actually working <laughs> on contracts. So right. that's past performance. Right. Yeah, yeah, so, so, yeah, definitely. So you have advantages uh, um, already, like, working in your favor. But a lot of times, like I said, people, we don't see the obvious. And so, you know, that's why, you know, I'm starting to do these calls now to share your story with others and to share other stories with you. So you could kind of, rec- you know, start seeing some of the things that are already in front of you and saying, wait a second, I do have some things working in my favor. Like you said, you, you know, you have opportunities that you've turned down. Other people are looking for opportunities to turn down. <laughs> so, 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 I mean, you know, uh, like they said, one yeah. man's treasure is another man's junk. You know, it's, it's, I, I, that's the way I see it. Like, you're throwing away stuff that people are, would die for and vice versa. Yeah. I, you know, I see that all the time. And it's hard for me to tell people that because they, because a lot of times uh, when people look at me, they look at me like I have it all together. And, and, and that's not true. I'm a human being. Um, so, you know, I've had to start off from the bottom. I've had to work my way up. I've had to establish contacts. I have had to establish relationships. I have to maintain contacts and maintain relationships. So I have to do a lot of this stuff. And some of you out there already have, you know, what I would consider privilege, right? But you don't see it as privilege. Yeah. Because yes. you're looking. And you're I'm going to start looking more person. closely. Yeah. You're looking at the next man's cup. You're looking at the next person's plate, but you already have privilege. Yeah, man. Hey, man. I, I, once again, I open it. Yeah, man. No, well, that's what, again, and that's what we're here. That's you know, that's what I'm here to do is to try to help people see these things because um, I'm the guy on the other side trying to knock on the door and get in, and you're there, um, and you don't, and you don't even realize it or take advantage of it or utilize the things that you have. So, hey, I man. really appreciate it, Edward. Listen, I hope I helped you today, buddy. Um, yes, you did. Listen, yes, you did. It's great talking to you. I hope the next time we get together, you can tell me some more good stuff, man. It's exciting, buddy. Definitely. I appreciate you. Thank you again. Hey, no problem, boss. Listen, anything we can do, send me an email or get back to me um, in some other form. You know how to reach me. I'm all over the web, internet, LinkedIn, every place. Okay? Will do. All Thank right. you. Thanks, buddy. Take care. Talk to you soon.